AI just amazes. Look at this drone shot of IIT Madras. It's actually fake. It shot using my camera and 3D model was created by AI. Look at this app. It can take notes of what my professor is teaching in class so that now I can sleep in the class and later I can come to room and I can ask questions and learn exactly what I want to learn. Even I can pick up Shah Rukh Khan and I can voice like Shah Rukh Khan and I can shoot the rest of the video. Even what I can do now. Chai go aye go. We're at the dawn of a new age, the age of AI. Open AI. In six weeks, these guys have gone from zero in valuation to now being a $29 billion company, okay. give or take. But on the other hand, many people have lost their job due to the rise of AI. First time ever they recorded uh, jobs lost as a result of artificial intelligence. IBM has become one of the first few companies in the world to go out publicly and say more than 7,000 jobs are being replaced because of AI. Including my friends who has been placed in IIT Madras and many surveys have showed AI is going to disrupt the job market. Like with all technological revolutions, I expect there to be significant impact on jobs. Now this brings us to the question how much artificial intelligence is going to impact the upcoming college placements including the placements at IIT which is going to happen this December. And second, if even IITs are being fired, is IIT still worth the hard work anymore? and followed by my five favorite AI tools that I use here as a student at IIT Madras to increase my performance and productivity. And if you are new here, my name is Raghuram Chandrakumar. I am a master student at IIT Madras. And if you are someone who is watching two or more of my videos, it's God giving you science to subscribe my channel because more useful contents are coming for you. Now, the reason I made this video is when I got school first in my 10, my parents told me, better just keep this order till you are told standard. Life is set. And I'm still at IIT. Now they are saying, if placed in IIT, your life will be set. I don't have any courage to say anything in front of you. So this video is a counter response to your belief. Truth be told, before the rise of ChatGPT and AI tools, getting a job is less competitive. Congratulations. You got the job. Compared to now. Previously, it required a certain level of education and work experience. But after November 30, 2022, the introduction of ChatGPT, the job market has been affected a lot. Goldman Sachs mentioned 300 billion jobs could be automated in some way with the newest way of artificial intelligence. The reason it was mentioned newest era of artificial intelligence is because AI has been there for many years, but recently it was so popularized due to the rise of ChatGPT. It takes two years for Twitter to get 1 million users. It takes 10 months for Facebook to get 1 million users and it take 2.5 months for Instagram to get 1 million users. It took Pinterest 5 months to get 2 million users. It took Angry Birds 34 days to get 2 million users. I guess how much for ChatGPT is just 5 days. Every other hour when you're on ChatGPT, the website shut down because of the amount of activity. Mm -hmm. Actually, I need 5 days, day and night to create one video for you. So please subscribe. I'm putting a lot of hard work to be honest. But the things are really worse right now. If you look at the history, whenever a technology was born, it always results in a loss of particular job sector. For example, in India, during the British colonial period, the introduction of advanced textile machine results in a loss of jobs for many handloom weavers. After independence, due to the rise of agricultural development, in third agricultural revolution, it takes out many small farmers who could not afford to adopt these new technologies. When telephone came, landline operator jobs are gone. But the harsh reality is artificial intelligence is almost available in every field. Trust me, there are AI tools that can automate the work in sales, market, even a hiring people. And recently, GitHub launched an AI tool called Copilot that can suggest how to finish your code as you write a few characters of it. And almost every company starts to incorporate AI into the system. Even Indian government invests heavily on the development of AI. As for the recent survey, it was expected India will increase its investment on developing AI to $885 million in 2023 compared to $300 million in 2019. Air India makes $200 billion investment on AI and the consequences are immediate. In the recent survey, World Economic Forum expected artificial intelligence will disturb 85 million jobs throughout the world. Up to I read this article, all the data I have seen gives negative news, but in the same these advancements, these investments in AI, it's not a curse, it's a blessing. Let me explain. Not only artificial intelligence is enhancing our life, on the other hand, by the way, I'm going to share my six favorite AI tools. 
that I use in IIT Madras to increase my performance and productivity. Artificial intelligence is expected to create 95 million new jobs. Survey by World Economic Forum mentions top emerging professions as data and artificial intelligence, pattern creation and cloud computing. Now, whatever I told before, try to look it in a positive lens. For example, healthcare institutions started hiring data scientists, AI specialists to integrate AI tools for diagnostic patient cares and drug discovery. Believe me or not, data science and artificial intelligence has been even used in cricket. Recently, I talked with Deepak sir from Gooby. He's an expert in this field. Yeah, hi. Uh, my name is Deepak and I'm working in Gooby as a program head. He mentioned this. And another exciting data that I can, you know, share about how data science is playing an important role in sports is, let's say for example, uh, yeah, sports also. So, you know, in terms of you take Virat Kohli's like last three years performance. Okay. So, he was not able to perform well to the, you know, extent that he has been performing before last 15 years. So, what had happened is there was a small, you know, research done by the data scientist of different uh, you know like uh, teams so what they particularly found out was after Kohli enters the seventh ball that they bowl to Kohli should be outside off stump okay fine so what happens is and you have to keep two to three slips away basically oh. so the research done by them was able to you know crack Virat Kohli's wicket on regular basis oh. that's the reason for the past three years he was not able to score that hundred that was there oh, which was scoring a lot yeah. These are some, you know, like uh, applications of data science, which will be more interesting. So it's not only about these things. You have so much other vast field that's available and the market, job market is huge. huge. You have more than 1.2 lakh openings in data sciences as of now. Oh. That's the demand for data science actually. So, by the way, what is GUI? GUI is an edtech platform incubated in IIT Madras and acquired by HCL and notably created a Guinness World Record for the most users to take an online computer program lesson in 24 hours. Here they teach in demand skills like artificial intelligence, data science, full stack development, UI, UX, DevOps by expert professionals from Amazon, PayPal in your native language with 100% placement support. In the last year alone, 5,400 students have been placed through GUI in high tech companies like Flip card amazon paypal just pay which is more than the students being hired from top institutes like iit madras iit bombay or delhi this is possible because they have an mou with 2500 top tech companies means these companies demand students from gubi each year they are so expert in this field they provide placement not only to engineering students but also to students who got graduated jobless and even irrespective of your program also whether you are art student medicine student you can also get placed through gubi and if you are someone who is looking Looking forward to get a job in this high demand skill or looking to upskill your knowledge in this field, I recommend GUI because apart from visible research, they also provide 30 hours person to person live guidance for the students. More details about the admission and recruitment process in the latest part. Now here is the catch. If artificial intelligence is bam, oh boom, then Raghu, why did you mention first AI disrupts the job market? Why did you say even IATs are getting fired? Why people are getting fired? I have seen many blogs or something like that. People IITians from top tech companies like Amazon or something like that, they're getting fired. Uh, so what what do you think is the reason for that? So a major problem that we have with our Indian mindset is basically we are stopping our learning after a certain point of time. Cool. So once you move into IIT, so what happens is, you know, you feel that, okay, I've achieved the, you know, the yeah. maximum that I can. So that's all. I'm not going to learn anymore. Okay. That kind of a mindset has to be, you know, like taken away because this is where I said in the beginning, I made this video specifically to my parents because they told me once I get into IIT, AD live set and my friend Ganesh told his parent also said the same thing and my friend Sriram told his dad also told the same thing so people have this notion like after 10 day life, life is settled after 12 study hard <laughs> but life settled like after college life settled uh, like get a job life settled but like, uh, I, I don't think it is true or something. So what do you think about that? Well, that is the biggest lie in our, yeah, uh, you know, yeah. our times. Because the thing is like, see, I'll tell you, uh, learning never stops. I'll, I'll give an example of people, students who have had 33 backlogs. That guy was a topper in 12th standard, oh. a district topper. Oh. And after joining college, he had around 33 backlogs. Back. As I told you that myth is there after 10th standard, 12th standard college, your life is set in nothing like that. You know, you have to keep on improving yourself. So recently, like not during to recession or something or during this uh, chat GPT rise or something like that, there were many job markets, including creatives. Many were like uh, lose their jobs. They were afraid that AI is going to take over. Correct, thing like that. So, is it going to future affect the placements of any colleges, whether it's IIT, tier two, tier three? So, how it is going to affect the job market? 
See, to be frank, uh, you know, like AI cannot replace humans. That is one thing that I wanted to suggest you at the beginning itself. Can so I it cannot replace humans. But what it can do is it can elevate the work of the, let's say, for example, if you're doing some particular job over a period of around six hours, okay. now it will reduce your job to around two hours. Yeah. So it's going to, you know, increase your productivity. Okay. But one thing that I can be 100% sure is you have to upskill, keep on upskilling yourself. So that's why they say like AI cannot replace Correct. humans the person who is using AI can replace exactly okay fine so in today's fast paced world if you want to get a job or thrive in your new job or even survive in a job you have to keep learning so always stay driven and especially the parents who are watching and the students who think life will be set after you reach a particular accomplishment I just want to share this quote from my all time inspiration APJ Abdul Kalam sir on success I would like to hear from you a few tips for the upcoming generation to succeed in life well succeeding life i have already told you yeah. you have to do four things okay number one repeat with me number one you repeat number one great aim great aim i will i will continuously acquire knowledge how oh, i will do hard work i will do hard work i will persevere i will persevere and succeed and succeed okay that's the mantra Thank you sir thank you so much so take action right now and commit to become a lifelong learner and stay driven now we'll talk about the admission process and details of the courses in gubi and followed by my favorite ai apps that i use as a student in iit madras to increase my performance and productivity let's go so we have a particular program called data science which which includes the uh, chat gpt part as well so what we do is we have something called pre boot camp a lot of institutes in india what they do is basically they'll give them a signed of a free demo for them where thousand people people would be attending the demo so they wouldn't have a clarity before joining any program yeah. so what do we do is we we have something called pre boot camp where the student will register which is a completely refundable fees basically yeah. there'll be three people you will be meeting in person one with the hr team another with the placement team and the mentoring team pre boot camp two days training would be given from our end <laughs> so where we will analyze them what level they are in based on that we will analyze the batch for them so like if a student is completed the pre boot camp and he decided to go to the main boot camp so what is the entire process till getting it got it what guvi does is as i told you we collect the jds from the companies job descriptions okay so 3 months from now 5 months from now how many you know requirements that they have we train the skill we add on skills mm -hmm. based on the jds okay. and we train them based on the jds okay. now until date we have placed around 5323 students okay till yesterday and uh, that is basically just imagine 5300 students is basically comparing to college the entire college on a single year what they place we are doing at tenugudi yeah, so it is in the past one year yeah, so today friends so right now we are in uh, in going to interact with some of the alumni so we are going to ask about their experiences and everything actually my favorite experience is mentoring each and every don't they explain very very good the interaction section is most beautiful the one to one each interaction section is very beautiful classes edukkanga namma and the class solra vidham like and namma own language la solli irukanga okay so they tell in their own language uh, yeah. okay fine favorite instances uh, are placement i received uh, offers from different different companies of good package uh, after the completion of my course they requested me to do the projects based on the which i course and i done the project feeling more uh, Con better confident and everything so finally i got a offer from company which i am currently working in the first problem i face as a student i have to read a lot of books and i have to read a lot of journal papers and i have to attend a lot of classes apart from that i have to use to write script for my youtube videos so it's very difficult for me to write handwritten that's why notion helps notion is a note taking app powered by artificial intelligence you can assume notion as a combination of google docs google sheet plus chat gpt here not only it makes me easier for organizing my notes i can use the power of ai to ask whatever the resources i want i can embed here from YouTube videos to audio file to PDF I can access everything in here without going out of this app next i am a student and i often have to read books and especially while assignments i need to search a particular answer in a book and it takes a lot of time So recently I came across this app called Docu Ask where you can simply upload a document in any language and you can simply ask a question related to the document and you can find now uh, I'm going to upload a document that is uploading 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 okay so I uploaded a document technology like artificial intelligence uh, leading to leading to unemployment So I asked the question. Okay, 
Yes, technology like automation and data, you can see how the response is here. It's actually a paid version, but if you are smart enough, then you can use as many times as you want. Understood, no? <laughs> now, now, as a student, I have a lot of emails to send and receive, but writing emails is hectic. And if you are writing to professionals, then you have to write accurately and properly. That takes a lot of time. And many of the time, before sending the mails to my professor, I question whether the tone is right or it is appropriate. This is where ChatGPT Writer helps us. It is a simple plugin that if you install in Chrome, it will show a small pop-up in your Gmail. You can generate a response with a simple small prompt and boom, you are good to go. Now, I'm an IRA student to be honest and I'm not that much good at understanding. So whenever I stumble across something while reading something, no one can really help me because my friends are usually doing some other projects and I wanted the explanation to be so simple. So this is where I use ChatGPT to be honest, ChatGPT's potential is phenomenal. My friend Gautam uses ChatGPT to create codes for his simulations. And during my IES, I don't know how to evaluate my performance in writing sessions. So I write the question and answer in ChatGPT and I ask to evaluate and ask for the feedback. That's now I'm a student. I have to offer you presentations. I often have to create report of my work. I often analyze the research data using an Excel sheet. To be honest, if you are not familiar with Excel sheet, then you have to spend a lot of time to do all of these jobs but not until microsoft introduces copilot 365 it's an artificial intelligence integrated to microsoft 365 product apps i still remember i have to give an important presentation for an academic meeting from my researcher and i know pretty much that to make a presentation it takes a minimum day but i just used my report and i told copilot to create a presentation and from that point onwards i just tweaked here and there and i just finished the work in what to do us and other example is like at the same with excel i don't know about to you if you are someone into research you need to collect a lot of data from the findings and you need to analyze it and to create a trend understand the overall percentage take a lot of hell time but after microsoft copilot 365 was introduced i can simply ask copilot to analyze the data and with the right prompts, I can get the graphs I want in a minute. So these are my top six favorite AI tools that boost my performance and productivity in IIT Madras. 